and I am back with another video. This time we are going to be going over May sneaker releases. So we're going to see what I like, what's profitable, what I think everybody's going to be going for, and everything like that. So without further ado, let's move this. So honorable missions, uh, obviously are going to go to these, where are they? These Amani Leodors, the tan and the less tanner one, the brown and the tan or whatever. Uh, definitely, I don't know which pair I want to try to get. I might try to go for, depending on how things look, hmm, I already got the white. Probably, probably this one. Probably this one. But then again, I, who knows? We'll just change it up. Uh, the Puma, you, you already know. This is a little Easter for kids. Um, it has potential, but I, I don't think that's going to be reselling just in the climate we're in. Uh, they're going to start the Gamma Forces. So look for they're, they're starting the Gamma. They're $90. Wow. Wow. So like $90. That's what the dunks used to be before the hype beast hot dog. Uh, that's that's a good colorway too. It's a good simple colorway. Uh, let me see how much are men. Okay, so all these are women, and there's a lot of gamma forces. How much are the men's? I, that's gonna be interesting to see too. How how much are the men gamma forces? Because they're gonna start so status uh, collab. Uh, it, it these these really are ninety dollars like. Don't be surprised. Don't be surprised if you see people. Oh man, I always love Gamma Force. Not in not in like four or five hundred dollars, like three hundred dollars. Uh, I, I could have swore we just got these these questions of oatmeal. Anyway, uh, the Mason Sylvia Dunk Low Blazer Dunk Mid Blazers. I'm not mad at these. I don't think they're gonna have any resale, but I'm, I'm not mad at these. These kind of remind me of the Tin Man, like that. Uh, or like an Oakland Raiders or Vegas colorway. Uh, I'm not. I'm not mad. At you. I don't think any resale. But if you pick these up, I'm, I'm maybe uh, the canvas dunk, black canvas dunk low, simple wearable shoe. It is what it is. I don't know resale right now, and you can pretty much get these on Hibbit right now if you wanted to for like 90 with a discount. Dunk low Gray Wolf SBs. Uh, any SB is tough to get. The resale on these is pretty much next to nothing. Still going to be impossible to get. Still going to be impossible. It's 180 bucks. Um, I want to buy these, but I would buy these on a sale. You know, just a simple shoe to put on. Uh, these water shoes, whatever. Cortez is. Color of the month. Air Forces. Now, I already know what people are thinking. Oh man, these are the colorway of the off-white lemons. Maybe um, it's not a bad shoe. I'm, I'm not hanging on it. Would I get it for retail? Re no, uh, a sale. Why not? Why not? Why not? Uh, pulses, jaws. Okay, that's ugly. The, look sort of like the chunky donkey. These jaw ones right here, but these are gray school. Or are these the same shoe? They're not the same shoe. Okay. Sporty and Rich Samba. Uh, these aren't bad. These, these aren't bad. These could be like a sleeper as a women's shoe. Never mind. Uh, sporty and women's. Women's. Okay. These are cool though. Like, no, this blue one and this cream and blue, these are nice. Like, uh, if you could fit the women's size, like, I guess I'd probably go up to a men's 10 and a half. These are super nice. Uh, Amani Leodor. New Balance 1906. Uh, is it just a gray pair? Or these these okay? You know these are a typical runner shoe. Whatever. These Air Maxes aren't bad. No resale, but it's a nice colorway. The Dunk Low UNLB Satin. Now I don't know how I feel about this one. I can't fit them. It's a women's shoe. Resale wise, the regular. UNC UNLV are pretty much and I'm just looking at the size is 10.5 to what is a women's a women's five is a, is a 3.5 so you would go from here to here and the only size that are producing would be this right here in a women's seven and that's typically only selling for like 300 I don't even want to log in right I don't know why stock is just cuts me out so Either you're gonna have to go really small 
but then again, that might not work out because it's five right here. I was just going for a hundred, so no. Uh, this is a women's six. A women's six is going for two hundred. So these are going to be like one twenty, I think, or whatever. You might be able to get some local sales, but I would say probably don't expect too much out of these. These are cool looking. If you don't have the, if you're, if you're a man and you don't have the UNCs, the UNLVs. And you don't want to pay the 200 and you want to just pay the 110 i'm not mad at you for this this is a good alternative uh and i wish everybody the best luck uh worth an investment po these are possible possibly worth an investment if you can get them for retail or under retail and you never know 110 turn to 200 you never know what these could go i'm not i'm not mad at these load up some more kd16s you guys don't care about those um I'll wait for these going to sell these punk omnis on. These look pretty cool. Vintage red. Oh, Reebok starting with the vintage. Reebok starting with the vintage. Uh, these are cool. These are cool. Re retail. Re I mean, sell. Solomon. Sandy. Uh, okay, we're going to move on for that. The Doritos. The Doritos. Going to be tough to get. They're already going for like 600 plus, maybe 500. Um. All I'm gonna say is good luck on these. The, I'm, I definitely want a pair, but you know, with skate shops and these raggedy, do uh, crappy bodders, it's it's gonna be tough. Uh, the Pharrell Adidas Samba Human Race. Let me take a look at that. Oh, they're doing it with a lot of colors. Are you hear it? Oh man, I don't like these because they got a lot of colors. Ah, why are they doing so many colors? Why did I can't do one color? I wanted just one color so I can sell the people. Ah, I can do it. Ah. The red's not bad though. Red with the raw high laces? Okay, I see. Mm. Green, okay. I would, I would say, oh, the black. How's the black? Okay, okay. well, let's start off with. Oh, all right, starting off with those colors. Uh, they also come with the, the white, the black. The red is definitely the standout as far as the colors go. Uh, not mad at those. But I don't see them. Oh, they're $200. How much are the regular Sambas? How much are the regular Sambas? They don't have a price. Okay, whatever. We'll find that out later on. Uh, $200. Wow, that's still surprising. Uh, I just I just seen these on the earlier live screen. These Jaw Tip Sacconi Grid Azula 2000. These are wild. Uh, I don't see these selling out. These are nice though. These are nice. I, I would say like catch these on a sale or like pick these up. Like I, these are just out there. These are really this is the. The outsole is really out there. Let me, hold on. Let me see the materials of this right here. Uh, let me see right here. Pink takes over. Pink suede. Zebra print. Floral pattern. Yeah, this this is like one of those shoes that's really stand out, stand out worthy. Um, I, yeah, I, I, this is a nice personal. I'm not mad at this one. It's really out there, though. It's not going to be for everybody. The Braun 20s, you see it. Freaked 4s. Okay. Uh, San Francisco Chinatown Air Forces, man, huh? Okay, white leather baby feature, a deep possible. You know what? These are cool. These are cool. Like the fade to the pink with the. These are cool. I and something tells me these. Aren't going to be easy to get. These aren't going to be something that sit around. These are going to be something like all San Francisco only. Probably loaded up small sizes, small numbers to sneakers app. So, uh, although these are cool, I, I, these are going to be like, I'm trying to think, the South Korea uh, soccer air forces and uh, Presto, they're going to be hard to get, but then sometime down the line, they'll probably like fade off. But these are, these are really cool, especially with that embroidered or debossed flower, embossed, debossed flower right there. That's cool. Uh, moving on. We got Chinatown Dunk. Hold up, player. 
suede check, suede, suede, got the embroidered. Let me read a little bit right here. Yeah, these are these are cop. It, it's a okay. Looking right here, I'm just on uh, number day nine. The top's loaded with stuff. Uh, on the same day, on the same day as the dunk uh, SB, um, these right here. I think these are probably easy to cop because, oh my God, I don't like canvas. I don't like canvas. I don't like canvas. And then a suede toe. Yeah, I I like these a lot. Hopefully, I can get them. But you never know. The dunk game is so unpredictable. These aren't going with anything on StockX, barely. But you never know. So even if it's going for nothing. You, uh, now. Okay, I'm kind of confused here because this is. Nike Airship area, and this is Nike SP every game. So, are these both coming out the same day, and are they both coming out to the same retailers? Because if they are Nike, clap it up for yourself, bro. People thought, look, I know you see it on YouTube right now. Oh man, these these airships right here. Oh man, sneaker of the year. I love these Air Force. I love these right here because they're kind of look like the Nigel Fresh ones, but. Yeah, now I'm waving it in your face. These are $600 and you might not be able to get a pair. Nah, nanny, boo boo, nigga. Nah, nanny, boo boo. You don't have these shoes. Uh, if Nike releases both of these and they. What's the, what's the hole? What's on this one? Let's see. Okay. Every game. Let's see. We're going to have this. Uh. Well, anyway. If they release both of these on the same day, man, the tears that people are going to cry. Oh, man, I never really like airships. I'm just showing you a nice colorway, but I didn't really believe in airships right there before. I never like airships. Airships, I don't I don't like airships. Really, man, what is Jordan Brand going to do? They're killing the ones. Jordan Brand, please tell me you're dropping two of the same shoes on the same day so people can cop. Oh, my God. Uh, so if I can't get the blue, I'm cool with the red. If I can't get the red, I'm cool with the blue. I just hope I can get a pair. That's 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 all I'm saying. Uh, LeBron's, come on, these Dunk Low, uh, what is he? Pink phones. These are you already know people are going to be eyeing these. These are like ninety dollars, and what are they going on stock it? Like pink foam Dunks, GS. What are they going? They're ninety bucks. Some going for like 160, 140. That's still like $50 profit. So you know people are I ain't got their eyes on these, myself included. Uh Nike Cosmic. Okay, whatever. Uh they kind of ran into the dunk mid. That style wise, cool, whatever, but I know it's not gonna be big. Uh people are coming after these. P it is men sizing. Nike Zoom Vomero 5. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You already you already know the vibe. Those are get with the Vomero hype right now. People are definitely coming after those. Uh, Romero. I know I'm typing that. Is that am I type? Oh, I'm typing in Zomero. I'm tripping. Uh, let's see. Warm blue. Okay, there we go. How much is this going for already? My size, of course, is going for 300 <sighs> spend nothing less. Okay, but it's up 180. So these are going like twenty dollars retail. Oh man. Okay. Okay. Still, still might just throw these in the collection if I can get them. But you know, uh, Nimbus rain clock. These are cool. These are yeah. I don't think it's going to be reset. But those are cool. Uh, skip pass dunk mids. Uh, no resale, but I wouldn't mind having a pair in the collection. Uh, the I don't know what these are going for resale. I'm not going to look. But uh, any dunk that's kind of simple like this one, it's going to be a 50-50 chance of it getting copped. Like, because the dunk hype is... People say, like, the dunk hype. Oh, man, the dunk hype is dying because of... Pan no, dunk hype is dying on resale because people are resale just dumping pairs. They're not dying with demand of 
regular people. Regular people still want dunks and pandas. Like they might have a lot of stuff, but people are still coming in every day, buying these shoes, getting online, buying up these shoes, bots running every day with getting these dunks and stuff. You can't get a pair of dunks on uh, the internet without some kind of hindrance, unless it's just like, I guess the black canvases, which I, it, it, like I said, the dunk game is also, it's kind of surprising sometimes. These are hard. These are absolutely gorgeous. Pink corduroy. Air Max. These are beautiful. The blue corduroy is still sitting everywhere. I'm definitely going to have to pick them up a pair sooner or later. But these, I, I don't want to say these are going to sell out more than the other Air Max, the other one. But these are just, mm. and I can see these, these are more wearable to like the average person. You could throw on like some essentials, some brown. You go all, the females could go all pink with this. You can wear a simple. I, these are just nice. These are very, very nice. So, yeah, I, I, oh, I hope people sleep on those, but I don't think those are going to go to the sale rack. Uh, Air Force One split. Uh, Okay, Vomero, the the blues the blue is better. Five eighty, okay. Born and red, okay. So okay, that's that's it. I'm not gonna get into July, but uh, it's some it's some heavy bangers in here. It's some low key sleepers in here. Some stuff is definitely going to sell, but I would guess my picks are these premium. Corduroy, these pink corduroys. Let's see. The dunk me. I, I probably wanna get try to get a pair of those in hand. I could have swore it was some Jordan stuff releasing. Like, does it feel does it feel kind of dry here without Jordans? I could have swore there was Jordans releasing. And I didn't see any Jordans. Huh. Matter of fact, let me go ahead and go to the upcoming Jordans because I I, I know that. The lightnings are dropping, and I didn't see any. I, I don't know what kind of list this is right here. No Jordans coming up. Uh, let's go back to sneaker news because, like, I, I, f I feel kind of I don't want to leave the video like that. Uh, okay, so yeah, elephant print ones. I don't like. I don't think a lot with of Allegra. Thank you. I don't think a lot of people like these, but I'm definitely gonna be trying to go for at least one pair. And I know some people have hit me up for a pair, so I'm, I'm going for these. I like those. Man, oh. These are cool. These are cool. I think probably these go on sale too. Uh, the two hate is real. These yellow snake skins. Look, these are selling out. These are selling out. Don't, don't. I want any YouTubers to call. Oh man, these are cool, but I got no, 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 no. No, I don't want to hear no. I don't want to hear no culture brochures opinion on anything. These are selling out. Look at their yellow snake. Women are going after these dudes who can wear nine. To a 10.5, they are going after this shoe. I don't want to hear. I don't want to hear any culture, any white dude or culture voice opinion on these shoes. These are selling out. Trust me. Don't think, oh man, I'm gonna walk to a store and get these. These gonna be no. Stop it. You're you're delusional. Stop it. Just stop it. These are selling out. It's summer. It's a, this is a summertime vibe. Look at these. Look at these shoes and tell me these are not. So, okay, whatever. Uh, Black thund these black thunders or regular thunders. Um, these, I want to be careful with this one. These are going to sell out. We know four hype is just oh my god, a lot of fours for some reason because I, 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 I'll explain the reasons. I think I have explained the reason why people love why culture divorces and why people love four. Oh man, a lot of four nine five five. These are not wearable every day. These are not wearable every day. Well, unless you just force it, and we know how they force shit. Like, it's going to black shorts and like yellow shirt, or yellow shorts and a black shirt. No, so these are going to sell out. Are they going to have any resale? If they do, it's going to be like a couple of months from now. It, it's not, I, I, I would be very hesitant to invest on these. 
I, I was thinking about it. I was like, man, maybe maybe these would be like the Red Thunders. But then that's red and red-ish and black. These are yellow. Yellow and black. These are not meshing well unless you force it. So um, maybe the grade school, as far as men's pairs, especially like the bigger sizes, I, I don't see it. These these gonna be a if you unless you plan on holding these for over five years, I I would not invest in these. I would not. I would more invest in the gray school if you're going for resale. Wearability, I need a pair and everything like that. But that's just my little thing with those. Uh, Tatum, okay. Uh, these are cool. I'm not mad at these. Will they sell out? I I don't know, but I like these. These. Air Jordan 3, Lucky Green, Spider-Man Across the Universe. Uh, as much as people hate on these, as much as people hate on these, hear me clearly. These are a Chicago. These are selling out quickly. People are going to treat these like the lost and found. What I mean by that, it's a Chicago that people are going to buy for, backdoor, and they're going to try to double and triple up. Even though they don't like them, it's still that Chicago, I'm sorry, color holds more weight. Matter of fact, let's just take a look at, it, at these right here real quick. Look at, it's a Chicago with Mitch, it's suede, it's patent leather, it's regular leather, it's this, it's that. It's still a Chicago. People are going after this shoe. So, anybody who tells you this is going to be easy cop, don't believe them. Don't don't believe people who say this is going. Oh man, this is going to be easy. People going to no regular person going to walk by. Oh, that's a Chicago OG high with other stuff. I'm still going to treat it like a Chicago OG high. Let's see. Uh, I see these right. There's, there's a picture I load up, but the Air Jordan One Low OG coconut, uh, a tannish colorway. These are cool if you ever take a look at the Spirit of Nigeria. Vibrations from Nigeria. Uh, I need a pair. I don't care. I, I need this pair. How much are they going for right now? One. Vibrations. So, also, these are going to be a neighborhood pair. So, like, it's going to be limited to, like, neighborhood stores. Um, basically anywhere, what was the shoe that just, it just came out? Uh, the Skylines, anywhere the Skylines came out, the, that is where these are going to come out. So asking price already 300, 160, nobody has these up. Hopefully these are going to be easy to cop. I hope they are. I really, I like these shoes a lot, man. You got that white leather. I don't know what that material is right there on the swoosh and the neck collar. All white leather. Let's see. Uh, I'm on this heel kind of upper collar. So let's go. Woven texture. Woven texture. Inspired woven texture. Yeah, I need these. I need these. Heavy woven. I need these. These are nice. Look at, look at these. These are hella nice. It's a simple, but then it also stands out with that wool. These are nice. These are these. This is a shoe of the year. This, this is a shoe of the, the cream bouncing off the white. Is it, man? These are clean. Look at these. These are clean, bro. Oh man, it's not. Shut up. Shut up. Shut the hell up. Shut the hell up, Culture Vulture. Uh, you have these laneys. I, I got one guy asked me to get these. Um. I'm not mad at these. These aren't for me. Maybe if I can catch a discount, but um, I wouldn't pay full price for them. But uh, yeah, these, these are cool. These are cool. But yeah, that's the entire list. We went from every shoe over there and went to Jordan. So uh, top Jordan, the snake skins. So anyway, tell me what your favorite shoe of May is. What you're going for. What you're well. What you're going for. And everything like that. So anyway, I'm going to catch you guys later. Uh, well, 
I'm gonna catch Twitch in probably like five minutes. I'm gonna be starting a Laura Crawl. But on YouTube, I'll catch you guys uh, tomorrow. I'll be uploading a live couple of the Wizard 3s. That's pretty much it. So anyway, I hope you guys have a nice night and I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.